to my channel. Welcome back to my 12 days of holiday sweat. Today is day nine and we are doing upper body with no equipment. So the only thing you need today is yourself, water, room to move around, and a yoga mat or a towel because we are gonna spend a lot of time um, on the ground today, all right? So clear up some space, get some water, don't forget to give me a thumbs up down below if you enjoy this workout and subscribe to my channel so you don't miss a workout from me. Get right into the warm up with some circles. Big arm circles. Here we go. Is to spend this day with you. Let me give you a Christmas and switch sides. So a little roadmap for you on this workout. We do have three circuits with four exercises. Each hold that arm off to the side and top. So three circuits with four exercises each. You know the drill, we work for 30 seconds and rest for 15. At any point you need to take a longer break, go for it. Take it to a oblique. At any point you need to get some water, at any point you need to press pause. Reset, go for it. Maybe kiss a bit and dream away. Awesome. Here we go. We're gonna do some pull downs here. Want you to squeeze your shoulder blade. Reach it up. Two more. Last one. Let me give you a Christmas. Awesome. Head to the end of your mat and take it to an inch more. Out to the side. Bring your right foot right next to your right hand. Open up your chest. And switch. All right, take back to that high plank. Then walk it up halfway. Stay right here on this high plank. We're going to do four shoulder push-ups all right so aim to touch the ground with your forehead keep the back leg straight three last one and four awesome we're gonna walk it back to that high plank I would like you to bring your hands right underneath your shoulders. You can either drop down to your knees or stay on that high plank. Keep the elbows right by your side. And give me four tricep push-up. We're going to be doing these today. So I really want to get you ready for it. Awesome. Back on that high plank. And walk yourself up. on the ground with the push-up. Now you can take that push-up down to your knee or you can stay up on your toe. Alright? So take it down. Hands underneath your shoulders. Make that core activate. And back to it. Okay? Slow elbows facing back. If you want to, your legs 
keep the on the ground. Okay, keep the a little high and in the ground level. But they don't have to come up. Okay, stay legs up, down, focus on your back. Awesome job, right from here, take it to a side plank and hold. Now you can be down on your elbows here, alright, stack them like I am, or you can take it down to your knees. Shoulder push up, so take it up to a pipe. 
the back legs are nice and straight. Now you want to slightly bend on your elbow and aim to get your forehead on the ground. You might not go all the way down, and that's okay, but just try. Holding up that plank, just the plank pull, alternating arm reach. Make sure your fingers are facing. 
your booties. Oh. Alright, here we go. Tricep and bear plank. So we'll start here. All fours. Take your knee off the ground. Step back. Either drop down to your knees or up on your toes. Step forward, step back. Step forward, bring you back. Push up, tricep push up. We really want you to focus on keeping that tricep right here. Push up. What's up? Alright, ready for the last one? One hand plank. I'm going to be facing you this time. Either on your toes or up on your knees. You just want to hold your plank with one hand. Anyone, pick left or right. And hold it. 30 seconds. One hand. Hold that plank. Hold that plank. 10 more seconds. You got this. You got this. All the way down. We're gonna do some swimming. So down on the ground. Arms go back. Just like swimming in the pool. You can bring your legs up this time. Engage your glutes. This actually should feel good. Swimming. Amazing walking plank. So center, three steps, three steps left, three steps right.
take it to the side, left and right, ready? One, two, three, one, two, three. Come on, go time, let's do it. One, two, three. One, two, and three. Last one, plank shoulder tap. And three, two, one. Remember what I said. Keep your hips in line with your heels, right? Be careful with rocking that hip side to side. Control, please. Take control. Focus. Slow down. You don't need to rush. There's no need to rush. Enjoy the journey, right? Three, two, one. Woo. Last stretch. Alright, stay right here on your knees. all the way up, all the way down, hold up the one more time, holding chest up, three, two, one, let's do the same thing with our back, deep breath in, bring it down one more time, just wanna love you, just wanna hold you, just wanna be with you till we grow up. Awesome. You can stay right here on your knees, that doesn't bother you. Take one arm across. Hold it. Bring it right. Here your chest. Three, two, one, switch sides. Don't go yet, all right? Let's finish this stretch. As important as the warm-up is, we should give ourselves between two and three minutes before and after the workout. Awesome, take it down to a child's pose. And as that child pose down, I want you to reach forward and try to get as far as you can on your head, okay? All the way up. Great, take it all the way to your right. Back to center. Take it to a cobra. And a downward dog. I just want to love you, I just want to hold you Again on that cobra Get your right leg down to the knee into a marmite and I want you to take your chest all the way down Up. 
all the way out there to that plank and more As always, thank you so much for joining me. It's always a pleasure to work out with you. I hope you have an amazing day. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up down below if you enjoyed this. And don't forget to subscribe. We have a few more days left on this challenge. And I'll be posting it work out at least one or two every week after this. Take a deep breath there, reach it all the way up and down. One more. Have an amazing day and happy holidays. We'll see you tomorrow.